Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation solution from here? What we have here, this follows when we have a times a, which can be written as a squared. But this here we have same thing multiplying. Also write it as nearest to power hex all squared equals to 36 on this side. The next step here, this follows from the law of indices when we have a raised to power m and a raised to power n. The same thing as a raised to power m n. At this here, this power multiplies. We have n raised to power 2x equals to 36 from here. The next step, we take the log on both sides. That is, we have log 9 raised to power 2x equals to log. 36. And from here we apply the power law of logarithm. Now we have log m raised to power p, the same thing as p log m. That is, yeah, this becomes 2x log 9 equals to log 36 here. The next step here we divide both sides by log 9. Divide this side by log 9. Also, divide this side by log 9. And from here, log 9 cancel each other. We have 2x left, which is equal to log 36 over log 9. The next step here, we can express 36 as 9 times. Four. Then what we have here becomes 2x equals to log 9 times 4 over log 9. Then from here, what we have follows from the law of logarithm. What we have log a times b. The same thing as log a plus log b this what we have becomes 2x equals to log 9 plus log 4 over log 9 then here we separate this into two fractions as this all we have becomes 2x equals to log 9 over log 9 plus log 4 over log 9. Then from here, we have log 9 cancel each other here. This becomes 1. Now we have becomes 2x equals to 1 plus log 4 over log 9. And next step here. 4 can be expressed as 2 times 2, which is 2 squared. And also 9 can be expressed as 3 times 3, which is 3 squared. That is, what we have here becomes 2x equals to 1 plus log 2 squared over log 3 squared. That is, here we apply the power law of logarithm. 2 comes here and also here. And we have 2x equals to 1 plus 2 log 2 over 2 log 3 which implies here 2 cancel each other and we have 2x equals to 1 plus log 2 over log 3 here the next step here we apply change of this from when we have log a over log b. This is the same thing as log a to base b. And what we have here becomes 2x equals to 1 plus log 2 to base 3. Then here also we divide both sides by 2. Divide here by 2, then divide this side by 2. 2 cancel each other here. Then we have x left, which is equals to 1 plus 
log 2 base 3 all over 2. So here we have the value of x in this given problem as x equals to 1 plus log 2 base 3 all over 2. Now let's check here if this satisfies this given problem. That is here we substitute the value of x into what we have which is x equals to 1 plus log 2 base 3 all over 2 here then what we have here becomes 9 raised to power 1 plus log 2 base 3 all over 2 times also 9 raised to power 1 plus log 2 base 3 all over 2 is it equals to 36 on this side? That is, yeah. This follows from the law of indices. When we have same base multiplying, that is, a raised to power m times a raised to power also the power of the same m. This can be written as a raised to power m plus m, which is 2m. That is, yeah, what we have becomes 9 raised to power 2 times 1 plus log 2 base 3 over 2 is it equals to 36 on this side then here we have this power multiply as these two here cancel each other then we are left with 9 raised to power 1 plus log 2 base 3 is it equals to 36 on this side then here we apply the law of indices a raised to power m plus n same thing as a raised to power n, then a raised to power n. That is, here, this becomes 9 raised to power 1 times 9 raised to power log 2 base 3. This is equal to 36 from here. Then 9 raised to power 1, same thing as 9, then times here, we can express 9 as 3 square, which is raised to power log 2 base 3. This is equal to 36 on this side. That is, yeah, we have 9 times. This power multiplies. We have 3 raised to the power 2 log 2 base 3. Is it equals to 36 here? Then, next term, we can reverse this 2 of from power law. That is, we have 9 times 3 raised to the power log 2 square base 3. Is it equals to 36 here? And this is the same thing as 9 times 3 raised to the power log. 2 squared, that's 4, is 3. Is it equals to 36 on this side? Then, when we apply the law of logarithm, a raised to power log b to base a. This is same thing as b. That is all we have here is 4. So we can say 9 times 4. Is it equals to 36 on this side? And of course, 9 times 4, it was 36, which is equals to 36 here. Now we have the left hand side equals to the right hand side. And from here, we conclude that x equals to 1 plus log 2 base 3 all over 2 satisfies this given problem. And thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell. Share this video, give it a thumbs up, and put your comments. See you next class and bye for now.